How do 4,000 women choose from 39 workshops a day by a variety of NGOs, faith groups, and professionals? That was a small dilemma compared to the challenges we heard being shared by 47 countries at the Commission on the Status of Women in New York. At the end of February, Liz Fast from London and I attended the 56th Commission on the Status of Women in New York with the theme of Empowering Rural Women. We learned that worldwide, women provide the major percentage of the working force, receive the least amount of education, and endure discrimination in ways you and I can't even imagine. A very special guest at the Commission was one of the Nobel Peace Prize winners, Lema Gobwe, who challenged us to look around our own space, to be a mentor, to encourage young women, to be a church that participates in social justice action, and to provide a moral voice to our young people. She said, it's not as difficult as it seems. Go back to where we started by investing in young women. Young women, that's where you and I began. I believe that is the direction Baptist women need to head now, investing in young women. We have some great ideas, and we want to hear from you how we can reach and connect and help you do that with the young women of your community and your church. What would Jesus say to us today? He gave women respect and dignity and opportunity when on earth, and he challenges us to do the same today. Please share your dreams and visions with us. Check out our Facebook page and our website for up-to-date information on our Women on a Mission Day on April the 21st, our Paddling with a Passion canoe trip in July, our short-term mission trip to the First Nation community of Mysticini, Quebec, and there's other events each month. Know it, show it, do it. Accepting Jesus, sharing his love, and taking action. We are women mobilizing women. I look forward to hearing from you soon.